my video got disconnected. It got disconnected uh, for some reason, because I didn't do it, but God did it, because I was blah, I was uh, blah blahing for seven minutes. He said, say things precisely, which is God will appear before you. Until that happens, nothing is going to happen. You are not going to stop your breath because you will die if you stop, you stop your breath. And that is impossible and they've turned the body into light is even harder than that. You know, stopping the breath should proceed before the body turning into light. Kannalyanam Kandain Ganga, this is uh, Maniki Vasu. And he said, I saw him with my eyes. Chandamarayan Nameni. His, how, you, how was he? He was like a uh, red <clears throat> lotus color, shining like millions of suns together. And I saw him. Then he, he just, just placed my, placed his foot on my head and I was done. I had an altered consciousness and in this consciousness I lost my rational mind but I was in bliss and uh, and that was an initiation and during Ramalingam's life what happened Shiva appeared many times and then as a light being hugged him and then uh, the brain started to function in a very different way and then this has been the way that most people got enlightenment. People who talk about enlightenment belong to a certain other category and then they die and then I'm not here to talk about them because uh, that is not my model or at least I cannot relate to that model. What I can relate to the model is a model of uh, of living a divine life, the life divine. And it cannot happen until you are blessed with it. Sri Aurobindo meditated all his life, uh, you know, getting into Pondicherry and uh, meditating four months in a row and coming out and giving a little bit of darshan and going back into meditation again. But he ended up uh, getting old and then blind. So he didn't have the grace. So the grace, this is the mountain of grace. I have no doubt about it. So I want to spend as much as my life here at this, uh, at this place going forward. And that's again cannot happen until he permits me and then blesses me with that. This is uh, this is the best thing that I had that has ever happened in my life and then I am going to share with you in many videos and also especially for those who have been studying with me in the one year program I have taken you through oh, through three or four years of uh, instructions and now what I'm going to talk about will uh, uh, completely take you to a different realm because that is that is how it is because uh, learning or in this earth plane you don't find anything Oh, instantaneously, time has to pass before we improve upon everything. That's the nature of the uh, earth plane. Um, so you have to start with the uh, 286 computer. I, I don't know if, if anybody, if many people will know about 286 computer. To a cell, you know, to a mobile phone that as that acts like a computer today. It's a matter of uh, 30, 40 years of time or more <clears throat> have gone since uh, 
we have come to this point but at least we are happy so what has to happen is god has to appear in front of you and that is going to be uh, the videos that i would be doing and how that can happen and how it's comparable uh, to other traditions uh where it is called some sort of an abduction you are abducted uh, into a light or taken into a different realm and changed and one thing that i remember i think i mentioned it before reagan <coughs> was going for his birthday party this is shirley mcclain who talks about it in her website and he was stopped by an alien and then said what are you doing here you have to become the president of the united states and uh, so he was delayed and delayed and delayed and then he has to come and apologize to shirley mcclain who organized this event see this is what happened to me and uh, there's a book called the regent's god and then let you know i can understand that book now after the getting this information who is an alien alien is a god alien is a god and uh, this harvard psychiatrist who wrote the book uh, uh passport to the cosmos i forget his name now was a great uh, a friend of uh, Shirley MacLaine he was into that into getting into a technology that can give us answers for our our uh, suffering we are all suffering no matter you may you may think that in you know, a billion dollar will give you uh, you know liberation no it can give you a good hotel room and then uh, maybe some have a good wine and then you know sex or what not uh but then that's not going to give you god a billion dollar will never give you god so you should be you know what is worthwhile is uh, being in the company of god is trillion dollar worth or it is no uh, you know you cannot <clears throat> put a value to that because you will be completely blissed out because you will realize your own identity as god so you know when you listen to me uh, this particular video is very different from other videos because i am speaking out from my own heart of what this all this about and uh, why are we you know like involved in the in the mad rat uh, you know in the rat race you know to get money and then get old and die so that has to stop and then people have to really uh, know what is life of stop it stop it and get do something about your own self realization 